welcome friends uh, this is the fourth part of this series and I have already discussed about creating and adding text using Java adding images in PDF using Java and working with color in PDF with the help of Java now this video is about how to encrypt a PDF file and add password to the PDF document so let us go ahead the required class we have is only two we can encrypt the PDF document with the help of standard protection policy class and access permission class the standard protection policy is used to add a password to the PDF document however the access permission is used to protect the PDF document so that we can restrict the user to perform operations like modify the content of PDF document or copy the content or print the document and so on so in this way we understand that we need only two class a standard protection policy and access permission class so let's go to know that how to work with these two classes to add encryption to our PDF document uh, number one is we have to create an access permission object so let's go I have already created a program that can create a PDF file the number one first one I have to do is create an object of PD document then create an object of PD page add the page and then create the content stream object by passing the document and page and then after begin text we can add text just like I have added a text here this is a 128 bit encrypted file then close the content stream and now you can save your file at your target destination now it's uh, time to know how to add password and encrypt our PDF files so let's add one method uh, private static since all these codes are written inside the main method which is static so I'm creating uh, another method with a static keyword and let me keep the name as set password and we need PD document here to set the password now first one step we have is to create access permission object so let me create the access permission object uh, import the class and then access permission object ap is equal to new access permission object call the default constructor and now let's see what we have to do. the second step is create standard protection policy object which requires three things the number one is owner password second one is user password and the third one is access permission object so let us do with the standard protection policy class standard protection policy standard protection policy and pass I'm putting one two three four as a honor password one two three four as a user password and the AP my access permission object now we have created our standard protection policy so the next one we have to do is set the length of encryption key so we are going to add encryption length as 128 here as pp dot set encryption key length to 128 now we have to set the permission of standard protection policy by calling the method set permission and passing the access permission object as a parameter so let's do this uh, spp dot set permissions pass the access permission object now we need to invoke the protect method with a standard protection policy as parameter on document object so let us do this by calling p dd dot 
protect and passing the standard protection policy object here we can see that it uh, throws an exception so i need to add here throws io in the main method before going to save the file i will set the password by calling the set password method and pass the pd document object and hence we have passed our document object to set password method and in this method we have added the protection to the file now it is saved and pd document is closed here so let us go to run this program and see whether the protection is working or not so i am running this program you can see build successful in within two seconds so now i'm going to see the result so you can see here our abc file is here in the e drive pdf demo folder and i'm running this and you can see the pro file is protected please enter a document open password i'm entering one two three four okay and you can see the text this is a 128 bit encrypted file so in this way in this way we can encrypt and add a password to our pd document file if you have already a file and you want to do the same you can use the load method to load a, a pdf file suppose i have a file already uh, with me in some path and we want to add uh, encryption and password to our uh, pdf file then just do this pd document dot load and call this load method with your path here you can add your path d colon slash something slash your pdf file name and after this you can pass this pd document object like this set password pd document and you can encrypt your file so you can create a fresh document encrypted or you can add encryption to existing files so it's not a big issue for you now thanks for watching and i will be here soon with a new exciting video please do not forget to like share and subscribe your favorite channel java mitra thank you